What is up guys, welcome back to another video here in the Cahaba River series. If you guys are new to the channel, my name is Adam Hosino and this is the Cahaba River series. What is the Cahaba River series? The Cahaba River series is a series where I'm doing a video in every single one of these trails here at the Cahaba River Park in Helena, Alabama. Now, it has been so long since I've done another video that they have added new stuff to the park so we're gonna go ahead and cover that really quickly i know they added let's see they added like six new trails cliff dweller yellowwood we got brb over here we got southern comfort that is a very long one southern comfort right there we have lily loop we have lily loop right here we also have not flying squirrel but we have flying turtle that's another one right there uh, let's see and I think that covers them all Yeah, so this right here is the map. Yeah, that's a reflection there This is the map of the Cahaba River Park and this is what the Cahaba River series is all about is basically Me trying out these trails and showing them to you guys that way you guys can see if you guys want to ride them or not um, but they also added this pavilion here that wasn't always there and then back behind there is a little changing station but now we're gonna go ahead and start the video i don't know all right guys well this is it that is lily loop right there that is the end of flying squirrel where you can consider it one of the ends you can either start here or over there and then there's another entrance for flying squirrel but this right here on my left is lily loop so we're gonna go ahead and get started. Here we go. Ooh, that's careful with that tree. All right, you there, we could have gone left or right. That's where the loop splits. I went right. Let's pick up the pace. Here we go. There we go, that was nice.
Ooh, here we took a right. Go, could have also gone left. Whoops. I think we're supposed to take a ride on that one. Yep, this is the entrance on this other side. That right there is rust bucket. All right, need to go back and take that right. Here it is. Whoops. Woo! That was close. That's why you can't take it fast on the new trails. <clears throat> Don't take them too fast. All zero clash. Your crash. There's the river on the right. Wow. Here, we take a right to finish out the loop. There's the pavilion.
There we go. So we started here and we came right back down. A little hint, if you, at the very first fork, if you take a right, make sure to take all the lefts so it can take you back. Same thing if you take a left at the first division, make sure to take every right. That's what happened uh, to me. I ended up going to a different trail, but I caught on and I turned back around. Also another very helpful tip, which I'm sure you guys may know this. If you guys are on a new trail, make sure to take it easy. Don't take it too fast. Get comfortable with it because like you guys saw, I could have crashed. I stopped myself, thank goodness. But yeah, just helpful hints there. This particularly is a very, very good trail, especially to start with. It's a nice little loop. There's some little jumps. There's some ups and downs, but nothing too, too rough. No rough terrain, no loose sand or anything like that. There is some pine straw, which can be slippery, but as long as you take it, um, take it easy, you should be good. But yeah, guys, that is the end of this video. Let me know what you guys to see more on this Cahaba River series. If you guys have more advice for me as helpful tips or tricks for me i would certainly appreciate it anything that you would like anything that you guys would like to see on this channel also let me know but with that being said i will see you guys on the next video peace